right guys so we'll be looking at our last letter family and our last letter family is called the zigzag letters okay and these sometimes can be a little bit tricky so let's see let's see if we've all got our whiteboard ready to practice and our pen to practice you might want to practice with me or you might want to practice and pause it is up to you so ooh, i'm going to use a green okay so uh, one of our zigzag letters are is v Okay, so I'm going to start from the line, do some flick, W, X, and Z. So, let's start with B. Okay, you can tell why these are called the zigzag letters because they do make a zigzag shape. So our V, we go on the line, okay? We go halfway up, down, up again, and flip. Can you see that point? It has to be nice and pointy, not a floppy one. Because if it looks floppy, okay, it might begin to look like a U and we don't want that. Again, our W. Same thing here, we go up, I mean sorry, we start on the line, we go up, straight down, horizontal, down, up and flick, okay. Our X, this might be a tricky one, so we go up, horizontal, down and we lift and then we go that might be a tricky one. Our Z, we go up, across, diagonal down, and across. Okay. Now this one, I made a little mistake. Why? Because it's not on the line properly. So I'm going to do that one again. So we're going to go up, across, down, and across. Okay. Now that one's much better. Okay, you can see that one's much better. Again, I'm going to practice these a couple of times again and again and again. Okay, again, I would like you to challenge yourself. You might want to join another letter onto them. So I know I practiced my A and S yesterday. Okay, so I'm going to join an A and my ooh, S. That turns into a was not bad okay and i might want to come up with another one. Oh, i know van so a hmm. quite nice and you can see how i'm joining it up too okay like i say you can Practice in your jotter, and when you practice in your jotter, you might want to go outside and practice on the floor, you might want to use chalk, you might want to use paint. It is up to you. As I say always, please post your pictures and your pictures of your work on Class Dojo, as I would love to see your beautiful handwriting and letter formation. I will see you tomorrow for our last session of English, and we will be looking at non negotiables all in English. See you later tomorrow, guys. Bye.